Hi guys, I don't have an intro yet. Although my intro was super simple. I'm actually creating a proper intro, but I mean when I actually start speaking. Though my intro was super, sim uh, super simple before and I was like, hey guys, it's me, Faye here at Faye Dusk. Obviously, I will be saying, um, I'm gonna be like, hey Kitty, hey, it's Keisha. Hey, and that's pretty shit. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I was thinking toying with like hey dream weavers or something like that because it's the enchanted dream catcher But yeah, so we're gonna go with hey. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go for it So hey dream weavers welcome to the enchanted dream catcher. It's me Keisha and I'm the face behind the enchanted dream catcher and if you're new here then awesome welcome and I love you to subscribe and hit that bell so you get notifications of when I post new videos. I plan on uploading twice a week, Wednesdays and Fridays, and it's going to be a lot of uh, witchcraft videos, some lifestyle videos, some beauty videos and all sorts of cool stuff. So let's jump into this video and I have a, a haul. A haul, a haul, a haul, a video haul. I haven't done a haul for like ages and ages. And it's a book haul rather than a video haul. Sounds stupid. It's a a pretty big haul. I haven't done one for so long and it's like so excited. I'm so excited. Literally. This is how much I love you guys and how much I actually wanted to wait to film my haul I have that bag of stuff from the works I have kept I bought this stuff the middle of February and I have not used it gone in the bag or anything because I've wanted to wait to film this for you guys and it's now coming towards the end of May so that is March April May so I have waited three months to use this stuff because I want to show you guys what I got and then yeah and also as well going forward because I do do um, book hauls every so often going forward now I'm good when I do hauls like a couple of months later I will do book reviews on some of the book hauls that I do and stuff so I think that's really exciting and yeah so let's jump in so basically what I have I have mainly stuff from the works. I also have something I bought from Amazon and I uh, something I bought from a um, independent business online. So let's go. Boom. <laughs> that was pretty cool. So this is what I bought from Amazon. Um, I think it was $12.99 maybe. But I really, really love it. I haven't used it yet. It's actually called Witching Hour. It's a journal for cultivating positivity, confidence, and other magic. It's by a person called Sarah Bartlett. And so uh, the it says, The modern witch is empowered and determined and she defies expectations at every turn. But even the most powerful, the most all-powerful sorceress sometimes needs a quiet moment to reflect recharge and maybe cast an enchantment or two this guided journal encourages you to set aside time for your own personal witching hour use the spells charms and incantations within its pages to conjure self-confidence summon success nourish friendships banish negative thinking and master the magic of self-love filled with mis uh, mystical illustrations of plenty of witchy wisdom this journal has everything you need to lead your best and most magical life like that is awesome so I just really love it. It's a little bit smaller than I thought, but I I wouldn't want something like super big. And also as well, I like that it's hardback. Especially with journals, I find if you're using them constantly when they're either card or flimsy paperback, they get all bent out of shape and ruined, whereas this is nice and sturdy. I really like that sort of starry design. Um it also has a ribbon marker, which is really cool. So you'd you can mark your place the illustrations it also has the sort uh you probably can't see very well because of the lighting but it has the contents as well so chapter one is self-worth and charisma uh two is love and romance and you've got a chapter on abundance and prosperity uh, prosperity uh you've got a chapter on home and well-being uh lifestyle uh dream goals friendship mentors see i just absolutely love love the feathers and that sort of native american indian vibe and 
uh, that sort of dream catcher vibe and I just absolutely love I think it's the Native American in me I'm just so called to anything like that so sort of how to be a witch oh that's really cool the witch's oath so before you start the journal you first need to take this oath a promise of intention to good um yeah so that's really cool so there's like an oath there and then you sign it so that's really awesome and then we go on to the first chapter uh self-belief is a self-belief enchantment which i really like it's listed the crystals along the top um and then it has uh, what you need and then it has what you do for the spell and then also i like that at the end of the spell there's a little bit there's a few lines to say how does this spell resonate with you right now what self beliefs are you cultivating uh christmas enchantment it seems like each that's so cool this one is a confidence booster and these are rocks and on each rock you write your best qualities that's so awesome and you do this one during the waxing moon i don't want to give it away everything away too much but it's actually this book i just cannot wait to use this book is amazing i've just literally come this page still in the first chapter on self-worth and charisma is animal spirit incubation in 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 innovation incubate in vocation god i can't even speak that's horrendous um oh wow it's all about finding your spirit guide that's so cool this is choose your animal I'm literally skimming over this because I don't want to give everything away in case you get it, but it's so awesome. There's horse, butterfly, obviously butterfly's my, which is changeable, fun and playful. It's dog, swan, it's really, really cool. The mirror magic, let's flick through a bit. And this one is on love and romance, getting close to spell. I just love how there's places, to, things to do and journal and loyalty, love not. You got a triquatra there, so cool. Uh... Let's go further. Harmony in the home spell. So that is from the home and well-being chapter. I just love how it gives you everything you need. It tells you what you need to do. And also it's well, it's really simple uh, spells and rituals. It's not like really complicated, really long-winded stuff. So it is stuff that you can do if you are, if you're pushed for time. And I also like how it gives you little page, little um, place on the page to either reflect or write down how your experiences went and success and creativity magic motivator it's it's just such a cool i really really love it i can't wait to use it it's just a really cool really really awesome idea and obviously then you got your page marker as well and i just i would just, definitely obviously i'm going to do a proper book review on this for sure but i would definitely from a first look i would definitely recommend recommend this book definitely recommend this book it's really really it's just the oh ah pins and needles and sitting cross-legged on the floor it was just it's just a really nice sturdy book and i really like how it's laid out and also as well it's nice that it's a journal and a spell book sort of like all in one so i really 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 loved that so moving swiftly on um before i go on to the work oh, ah, let's get on to this bad boy so i don't know if you've heard i'm sure if you're big sort of like if you fought like um if you're quite active like on instagram i'm sure you would have heard of the uh, witch's planner so i think this is vegan leather it's quite it was quite expensive but it is all handmade um it was i think i got it on sale but i think altogether with shipping it did cost me about 40 pounds maybe it's expensive but i it's i love it so you could use this as your book shadows as a diary as a planner as a journal whatever you want really to record your spells your experiences your feelings whatever and this is a nice accompaniment um with this these go together quite nicely and also as well i will open it up that's just an invoice uh so it's a lovely like a filofax type type planner so you've got some pockets there you, and you've got a pocket there and a pocket there so you could 
have whatever you want there really you could have spell cards you could have anything really and um so that's the witch's planner so this is a ring six ring binder uh, you get a pen with it as well and there's a pen loop so you could change it out for a pen if you want a different pen this is the 2019 one but there is going to start to be printouts um every year so it'll be a 2021 you can also get a digital version of this well obviously you don't get the actual physical binder but you get the inserts on a digital format so i like that other mean phases just really pretty uh so I just really like, so I didn't buy this till April, so this is from January, so I haven't taken it out yet, but I will take out all the old, uh, old ones, and yeah, I will take out, so each month, it's so hard to see because of the light, but I go back further and I feel like, give me hide my head, I was trying to focus on my face is it focusing on you maybe i don't know but so each month it says it's a new year a new day and a new opportunity so each month january so first week one there's some goals there's a box to write goals positive thoughts your budget notes and your main focus and then that's the start of each month and then you have a page for two days so it's the 1st of January and then do your journal reminders to do and the today I am happy because and then the next day the same thing and then the next day and next day and so on and then it's got uh you can sort of fill in what the, it's got like a circle so you could fill in what the mean phase was if you wanted to so each week starts with goals positive thoughts budget notes main focus and then you have the deal journal and everything else it's like a small like you couldn't write loads it's only like a few lines but if you're if you like that it's annoying that you can't really see, it doesn't really show up but it is um super cool so i'm trying to flip as well i mean at the end of each month there's sort of like it tends to be a little bit bigger note section but that's cool so when you get to a sabbath on a month it's a sabbath which you can't see again which is really fucking annoying uh what do you see just so that one particular one's in bulk so for Imok, and it's got a sort of sigil at the top there's a ritual plan altar ideas note and notes and it sort of gives you what the sort of um what the sabbath incorporates this one obviously for Imok is sort of feminine energy new beginnings fire and passion and then you go back to the journal again and then march so each month trying to find but she also has a uh, different i didn't buy any of the other inserts i literally just bought um i literally just bought the planner but she has other inserts she has um like tarot journaling inserts that you could buy um dream like her uh, sort of like dreaming ones all different types of inserts i think she does a few stickers as well uh that's what i was looking for um let me flick to the back because i haven't organized this yet properly but that's the moon phase calendar for 2019 so it gives you sort of the full the full moon uh waxing waning for each month when it's on uh, yeah it also gives you the new moon and stuff as well that's the wheel of the year which is really cool oh that's cool i haven't organized this properly yet but so there's an about me section i need to go through this and i will actually organize it i'll actually do a video when i've actually used this and filled it in and stuff just to show you so the about me section is sort of like my name is i was born on sort of you know your zodiac signs uh, like your favorite what's your say my favorite crystal herbs divination magic type flower recipe animal place color season who am i a picture of me you stick a picture in or draw one of yourself um i knew it my battery would die 
Um, then continuing on in the about me section, my journey began in, I am practicing solitary or in a coven. Ways that I practice my craft are by using divination herbs. So you just tick which ones you, which ones apply to you. Cooking, potions. Uh, three things I want to accomplish this year. Uh, three books I want to read this year. And then that's cool. There's like a little section for herbs. There's a little square that you could either stick a picture, draw a picture. And then you can write next to it a little bit about the herbs. Same format for the crystals. And there's, there's a, some spell pages as well. So... Oh, uh, you can't see this. Oh, uh, you can't just about just. So spells, uh, is it, so your name, tools, and the process. So that's cool for writing your own spells. Same with rituals as well. Uh, divination, what's divin what is divination? My divination tools. Uh, deities, same thing again. And then deities is the same thing again. Just what are deities and like what deities you use on the back. That's really cool. As a feelings chart for the year. So January through to December. Um, and the days like how you're feeling. So you could chart how you're feeling each day. At the bottom there's a routines one as well that's laid out in the same sort of format um that's really cool she's listed uh by um stephen wright who is whose instagram handle is a witch's path a brief history of witchcraft she's included in there there's also a few notes pages as well which is really awesome and then she sort of has a thank you at the back for the witch's planner and has her instagram facebook and email and then you have a another pocket at the back but it looks a really awesome sort of, I really look forward to, I'll try and zoom it a bit, or try and go forward a bit so you can see how uh, days are set out in the month. See, it's two days on each page. Let me find, we'll see if I can find one the Sabbath and see if I can zoom in a little just so you can see. I mean, I'm not sure if she has any any journals left for 2019, but I'm sure she will be doing her print run soon for the 2020, if there's no 2019 left. So you could get your journal for ready for next year. Uh, where am I? Sorry, I'm just trying to find, I think, Lassard. I'm coming up to Lassard. Lassard, yeah, there you go. Lassard or Lammas, however you say it. I uh, say Lassard. So this is a, on a month when there's a Sabbath, this is how it's laid out. Uh, so that's really, really cool. So yeah, I really look forward to using this, but I will definitely, for sure, as soon as I have it all set up and have started using it, I will show you how um how i have it how i have it set up and how i've been getting on with it so yeah it's a re it's a really cool um i really like it i just think oh my legs <laughs> i just think it's really awesome so yeah i will show you that but now let's move on to my work haul uh, so i bought all this together in this bag and then i bought this another time when i was getting mother's day presents but i was like i'm not gonna use this because i'm I have willpower, damn you, I got willpower. So this one, which I'm really excited to read, is Five Minute Magic for Modern Wiccan. Rapid Rituals, Efficient Enchantments and Swift Spells by Cheddarwin Greenleaf. And it's a really pretty sort of glossy sort of feel to it. And it, the RRP of it is twelve ninety nine. In the works, it was five pounds. For those of you that live in America and other places who don't know, the works is a huge discount bookshop in England, and you can get. They do have some. You can shop online and in store, and you can find some really good gems, sort of like on pagan and witchcraft books. And um, you can also find they do a lot of stationery and crafting bits, which you could use for spells and things like that. And yeah, it's a really cool really cool place 
so let's have a look it's not hardback per se but it's not paperback it's like that in between sort of like that sort of sh um glossy sort of card so i think it'd be relatively substantial uh, it's got uk the rp was so it was 12.99 in the us uh 19.95 so basically 20 dollars was before tax priced higher in canada but hasn't listed the price oh so it's really lovely so there's a uh contents page um yeah it looks really really nice i like i really like how it's oh sorry <laughs> i really like how it's laid out each month like that aesthetic is gorgeous so you've got a uh, book shadows you've got bowls of herbs you've got sort of candles sage sticks uh crystals that are absolute oils i just love the aesthetic it's so pretty so this one in the beginning is the witch's toolkit everything you need to know for making fast magic then it's got a list of sort of like what she deems to be essential tools and uh magical meanings of essential oils um, she's got making your own ma uh, manifestation tool. Then the first chapter, she's got every everyday lunar and solar spells. Uh, there's a gratitude prayer spell, for example. And she's got ground getting grounded in yourself, chakra clearing, um, centering, and visualization, foretelling your future, Mercury so sortilage. Uh, she's got so much stuff. Rites of passage spells for special occasions, birthdays, and beyond. Uh, an enchanted engagement, a cup bringing with health, vitamin C, T. Uh, there's a floor cleanser that you can make. Um, there's all sorts of really cool stuff in here. Uh, God about goddesses, uh, love spells, enchanted evening rite, new moon, charm for banishing heartbreak, directing your destiny, activate your third eye, uh, prompt prophecies. Uh, spells for days of the week there's all sorts of really pretty stuff solo spells for the solo practitioner it's just really really lovely stuff let me just give you a chapter uh, overview or what sort of chapters there are uh, so you've got witch's toolkit you've got everyday lunar and solar spells uh, solitary spells for solitary witches uh spells special occasions healing in a hurry so herbs tea herbs and teas for healing for yourself and your family money magic secrets for true abundance express lane love spells so attract to create keep create and keep love in your life rocking your life crystals gems and supernatural stones uh time is on your side making the most of every sacred day conclusion for your life with enchantment so it's just, it just looks like a really lovely book and I absolutely love the aesthetic and how it's set out. I just think it looks really pretty. So I shall get into this bad boy now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's not loads of stuff in here really, actually not as much as I quite remember, but I only got a few things, but I did get a few awesome things. So this from the work was just a was a pound and it is make your own 3d butterflies so you could use it for um presents like crafting thing and um, putting it on different things i really i like really like these butterflies they're really pretty and i just wanted them for my book of shadows and the process of creating and so i just wanted it for that really i also got Oh yeah, I said that was a pound, didn't I? This one I've seen for a while is called The Apprentice Witch's Spell, but set your intentions, unleash your power and change your life by a Marion Green. It's a nice little hardback book. The RRP is 14 99 It was four pounds in the works. And it's just a cute little book that I liked the look of, and I like the layout inside as sort of elemental magic, uh, power of the planets, Dream weaving, kitchen witching, the magic of time. Uh, it's all different about symbols, building a base for your magic, work, walking the hidden paths, spells of the earth, the being of fire. See, so it's just really, I like how it's laid out as well. So I definitely do a, a review on this. Pluto, keepers of memories, a cosmos spell, times, 
influence on magic cancer of the crowd as all sort of on the um different zodiac signs as well harmony in the kitchen dream weaving um there's just all sorts of all sorts of stuff in that so i just really just think it's a nice little book that will look super cute and i can't wait to start using it so these that i got that i was like drawn to it's a paint your own mandala stones the RP was seven pounds on this it was three pounds fifty so it's a complete starter kit i really want i've never done it and i really like the idea of it and it was, there's four river stones inside five acrylic paints two fine paint brushes uh five dotting tools and a 24 page book so a little books about getting started and how to create different mandala stones so i'm really excited hopefully i'll be able to create some really awesome things and i'll be able to show you and yeah so yeah i can't wait to use that um so it has a bit about getting started in there uh workplace kaleidoscope mandala so yeah can't wait to use that as well um i also got a um it was a stamp i saw that was um, reduced to a pound and it's um it's got like a really pretty sort of floral sort of motif on there in the bottom so it's two stampers in a pack the bottom one says if you never try you will never know so i really like that and i thought i've got some ink so i thought that would be really cool to sort of stamp my pages like in my book of shadows or journal or whatever really and then the last thing that i got in my haul was a uh picture me a journal to get your life sorted it's 9.99 i got it for five pounds plan your life to perfection uh, perfection in the stylist journal jot down all your dreams goals and plans to get organized be inspired to get creative and get life sorted so i just really like and it's really pretty as well and then this journal belongs to how to use this journal this journal is to fill in decorate and design complete each section to help you keep track of things and get organized this space is for you to jot down your life goals and wish lists as well as record positive thoughts gift ideas and music playlists use the monthly planners to make a note of the things you need to do from meeting friends to completing tasks and fill in the monthly mood charts to see your emotions in color don't forget to personalize your journal by adding decorative doodles and symbols to bring each page to life turn the page for more ways to use this journal that's a really cool idea and there's examples on that side of how to use the journal decorate that was decoration inspiration that's cool lights camera action what would be the film of your life be called brainstorm some ideas and write them in the clapperboards below superstar think of five talents you have and write them inside the stars it's just a really cool positive dream journal keep a note of your dreams and seat patterns to track and for tracking sort of sleeping and things it's just two plain dotted pages uh fun fact file fill the page with facts about you keep adding it over time to create a collection of memories and the next bit is life goals and wish lists so send your wishes soaring write a wish in every balloon if it comes true color the balloon in are there any wishes you you could help come true yourself that's a really awesome idea i really like that um overcoming fears tiny adventures uh movies to watch that's cool bucket list i like fill the buckets of things you'd love to do at some point in your life that's a really cool idea i really like that be creative so recipe ideas favorite people happy and healthy oh that's really cool a happy chart on the left side side of the chart write the things you do in your free time <sighs> of course i just ran out of space on my memory card so I had to delete a couple of old videos that I haven't, but I put my marked the page I was talking about. So the sort of happy chart, um, when you choose how often activities make you feel better and colour in a corresponding box on the chart. If you need a burst of colour of good feelings, look at the chart and do things that make you happy the most. That's such a cool idea. It's just a really nice book. Uh it's a really cool book. 
saving goals, there's present idea, uh, there's packing for holidays, five minute tasks, uh, month by month, that's cool as a month by month so you can actually jot down your plans say for April for example so you can keep track of your tasks, that's a really cool idea. And there's a, oh, there's a mood tracker for each month as well. The habit trackers, checklists at the back. Yeah, I just thought it was a really cool, a really cool journal. So, yeah, I just thought, awesome. Ah, my love. <laughs> oh, that's better. <laughs> so, yeah, so that is the end of that little haul. So, I will be doing book reviews and things like that once I've actually got stuck in and use the stuff so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and also as well i always love to get reading recommendations so if you have any recommendations of books you think i like or stationary bits or whatever then literally drop them in the comments below or send me a private message or dm me on one of these social media links which will be below so either instagram or facebook or twitter or whatever and yeah so until next time, keep dreaming.